a rare honour for us as Stephen Wilson Company to have this collection um, as part of our October Cape Town auction. It's very rare that collections or private collections of this magnitude come onto the market. Generally collections are kept in private homes for anything up to 47 euros. Um, and it's possibly the largest collection that we've had at auction. In uh, Preller's career, symbolism was central for the genesis of most of his paintings. And we see how the uh, ordinary world is transformed into something symbolic and distilled and powerful in a poetic manner. In his late work, there are very strong allusions to early Greek mythology. The early works are much more directly related to South Africa, particularly the Mapoch. And uh, if one looks at a still life like this, this is so dramatically different to an Irma Stone still life or a Maggie Loebsch still life. We all have seen eggs, but we don't necessarily paint them in a still life. And of course, once they're placed in the strange context of the beach, uh, they start to become mythological and powerful. So the eggs are about... Prella plays with these images so that they are constantly questioning uh, the interpretation. On Prella's return from the Second World War, uh, he, like many young men, were traumatised. And so I think these candles memorialise both his personal experience and the group experience. He's using them in a way which uh, did link his work uh, to many viewers to surrealism, but they, uh, I think, are much more closely associated to the metaphysical painters of Italy. And uh, in many ways, he's much more poetic than trying to be strange. <laughs>